Well, we got the Spider loaded up on the Stinger trailer and we're gonna take it out for its first ever actual trip. Uh, we've had the trailer since, uh, gosh, September, October, uh, maybe even August, I don't remember. It's been in storage. Uh, and uh, then we uh, went ahead and upgraded and picked up a, uh, uh, a newer vehicle uh, for travels for this new format of Spider travel. And a little chilly, so uh, it may not be the most comfortable ride, but we're going to get out there and take it up to the mountains for uh, for two nights and a complete ride day uh, up in the Blue Ridge Mountains, and uh, give us a chance to test the towing system, the trailer, the spider loading, unloading, packing, and uh, all the systems in preparation for our trip to Key West here uh, just a few months away. Um, that's going to be a, a good shakedown uh, for the uh, spider trip, and we're looking forward to it. Gives us a chance to get out of the house, and uh, what can I say? So how do you feel this morning, John? Perky. Perky. I got plenty <laughs> of coffee. Uh, the weather is not as cooperative as I'd like. It's only 54 degrees, but... but the sun's shining. The sun's shining. We're on we'll, the road. We'll go with that, and... This is our first road trip from 2024. Woohoo! <laughs> and uh, if you're wondering where the spider's at, look to the rearview mirror. Look, there you go. It's on the trailer. We're uh, testing the new format for uh, spider travel. Yeah, our maiden voyage. Yep. So cross, crossing our fingers. <laughs> you know my luck with toe hitches. So <laughs> yeah, good to have a test run. Yeah. It's gonna be fun. Our route today is to head up US 460, then the Beltway around Richmond, then Interstate 64 to Stanton, Virginia, where we have reservations at the local Best Western. So, uh, how did it do, the Stinger trailer? Well, <laughs> uh, really good. Uh, no complaints. It handled perfectly. No. Once I got used to the fact I was towing the trailer with the spider on it, it really was like it wasn't even there. So that that's good. Um, and, and you remembered that there wasn't someone tailgating you. <laughs> yeah, every time I look at the rearview mirror, I see a motorcycle really, really close. Uh, <laughs> but. Uh, that's that was not the problem and we kind of put you through the paces today didn't we yeah um we got stuck on interstate traffic because of road construction so we were to stand still for a while and uh and that was right after lunch of course you know the bladder gets full and then we were looking for an exit there's a gas station up ahead we made the left turn for the gas station there was no gas station at a country road windy a windy and narrow. uphill downhill narrow steep shoulders on both sides the first time driving this this rig in that type of environment, it's a little, and, and plus with the strain of with uh, needing to go to the bathroom, it was, um, it was a, stressful. A, a trial by fire. <laughs> so, what are you thinking? What I'm gonna have for dinner? Yes. I'm, I'm thinking meatloaf. How can you go wrong with meatloaf? So how's the meatloaf? It's really good, but it's uh, voluminous. Yes. I didn't mean quite that much. <clears throat> Aren't you many places you can go where you can get pinto beans and collard greens? And it's good. And it's no sugar. good. It's not from a can. After a comfortable night's sleep and breakfast, we unload the spider from the trailer and head west on US 250. In this part of the state, 250 is a two-lane road and crosses several ridge lines on its way to our destination, which is Monterey, Virginia, which has a nice little restaurant, which is our designated lunch stop. The ridge line crossings, which offers us a lot of vertical twisties. Motorcycle country. Yep. So are, go ahead. I was just going to ask you how you're feeling. Pretty fair. Pretty fair. <laughs> yes. Uh, sleep had 
a few challenges last night. Uh, two trains went by the hotel, one between oh. one and two, and the so other at 4.30. The train tracks are? Yeah. It's a good, it's a good hint to check Google Maps before <laughs> you make a reservation at a hotel. Yeah, it also explains the cheap room rate, perhaps, but... I was wondering why this Best Western room rate was $100, almost half price, compared to the other Best Western in town. Yeah. We stay at normally. And now we know why. Yep, yep, yep. But the Scenic Railway also uses that track, and that would be fun to try sometime. Yeah. They, they serve you dinner on the train. It's about a three-hour loop, I think. So oh. where, where are we going today? Well, fi first of all, we are on the Spider, and we are outbound for our test trip. And uh, we're going to head west on US 250 and uh, through the countryside and see what we see. We go as far as we think we should go. And uh, we've already achieved the goal for the trip. We took the Spider out here on the Stinger trailer, and we got the Spider off the trailer, and we're on a ride. Stanton, Virginia. If you're not from Virginia, you would pronounce it Staunton. But that, that's, well, that's, that's how they know you're an out-of-towner. <laughs> yeah. They put the U in to confuse you. Yep. And the uh, Stanton is uh, famous for uh, four of its locals who did good in the country music industry. The Statler brothers are from Stanton. They're long retired, I understand. Oh, one, maybe two of them have passed on, but... Uh, Isn't Woodrow w Wilson also from Stanton? Probably, but... And the school for the deaf and blind where my daughter works is in Stanton, I think it... And, uh... Yep. And there's a college here. I should know the name of the college, but it escapes me at the moment. The college in Stanton. So, a, a women's college. Is it Mary, <coughs> Mary Baldwin? It may know. be Mary Baldwin, I'm not sure. It's, we'll have it's just good to be on the spider. And it, I was yeah. worried about the temperature because it's reading about... Uh, 52 or something like that. Yeah, the uh, low 50s, but it feels pretty good. Yeah. We have on all the all the insulation. Yeah. You know, I'm thinking, the trip down to Key West, wouldn't it be just <laughs> so much easier just to load the Freedom Trailer up and just take this and just go? <laughs> <laughs> I just finished a hamburger and a chicken sandwich and reverse, parking brake is off. Looks like we did not have the yeah, original idea here. This place is full of motorcyclists. Yep, good day to be out and about. Well guys, we made it. Uh, the test run was successful, just got home a few minutes ago. We put about um, 500 miles on the Stinger trailer. It handled perfectly just as advertised. So we look forward to taking this uh, down to Key West here at about a month or so. Um, we did get the spider off, take the spider for a ride, and yeah, a couple hour ride was nice, but just to, just to test it. So 
all the mission parameters that we set out for ourselves for this trip, we uh, uh, checked those blocks off. So uh, uh, we're really happy. The only thing I recommend, if for those of you who are new at towing trailers, and I am, we took, I mean, obviously the Freedom Trailer behind the Spider all the way to California back, and multiple trips beside that with no problem, is Hitch Rattle. And we have the receiver on the back of the Forerunner, and the hitch goes in, and there's a little bit of play in that, and it tends to want to rattle. So what we did was bought an anti-rattle device off of Amazon, I think it was like $15, and it uh, tightens everything down nice and tight, and there's absolutely no rattle whatsoever. Um, strap stayed secure the entire trip, no rattling, no swaying, so... I'm really pleased um, with, with the trailer, so we're going to get it uh, unloaded and uh, put it to bed. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more of our travel related content, just check out the rest of our channel. And don't forget to subscribe.